In the year 2010, there was a mining incident in Chile, known as the Copiapo mining incident. Due to serious cave-ins, miners were trapped over 69 days. This raises the question, what we as humans have done to overcome this problem? Well, we, Team Robotics, have embarked on a journey seven months ago to find a solution for this problem. I'm Ramesh. I'm James Rin. And I'm Joshua. And let us show you what we have accomplished. Let me explain the core part of our project, the Max suit. This suit is a full-fledged, meticulously designed exoskeleton engineered to help miners with their mining tasks and to protect them when the cave-in occurs. This suit is equipped with four heavy-duty pneumatic pistons powered by an air compressor, which will allow the user to lift objects three times what the user is capable of. The suit also features a bunch of different sensors, including a temperature sensor, humidity sensor, and a flame sensor, all controlled by an Arduino Uno. The LCD installed on the back of the suit will either display the temperature or humidity, depending on which buttons are being pressed. If a high temperature is registered by the temperature sensor, the cooling fans and the radiator are turned on to cool the suit down. Apart from that, the LCD will also serve as a warning to the surrounding miners if a flame is detected, along with the alarm. The suit also works in conjunction with the, this helmet. This protective helmet is fitted with a light sensor. In the case of a power failure and the lights go off, the light sensor will pick up the darkness and will turn on the emergency backup lights. Let me continue on with the demo by explaining about Alpha V3. This is the third iteration of our Alpha lineup. This is also our most powerful and best version as of yet. Alpha V3 is a four-wheel drive vehicle capable of traversing on any type of terrain you throw at it. Alpha V3 has four shock absorbers providing individual suspension for each vehicle. Alpha V3 is powered by a 10,800 mAh battery delivering 7.2 volts in total. Alpha V3 features three ultrasonic sensors. These three sensors will enable Alpha V3 to roam around and operate on its own without the need of intervention or human aid. Alpha V3 also has a GoPro Hero 4 attached to the top which is capable of providing a 360 degree view which will be relayed back to the tablet located at the back of the suit. The final feature of Alpha V3 is its gas sensor. When a harmful gas is detected, a warning signal will be sent to the max suit, which will activate the safety mask to prevent prolonged exposure of harmful gas. So this project is codenamed Beta. Beta is an automated drone which will fly above the mine. Beta features an IR seeker which works in conjunction with the beacon found on the max suit. Beta was devised as a contingency plan in the right case that the max suit malfunctions or the operator of the suit sustains an injury during the game. The beacon to track the mine. For this demonstration, the following setup will be used. The seeker is tracking the beacon as it moves left and right. The programming languages where we are utilizing for this project are NXTG, DVTG, RobotC, Arduino IDE, and MyoMapper. In conclusion, we believe that this project is the key to a new age of effective mining and mining safety. Only then we will be able to reduce the loss of lives as well as to help aspiring miners to overcome their phobias of being trapped. Once again, we present to you Project Map. Mining incident. Due to serious. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry.